Happy New Year, ladies and gentlemen and basketball fans. Welcome to NBA.com for another rant. I'm Rick Kamla. It's not really a rant this week. I've got positivity in mind. I'm going to shower one of the greats with praise right here before you billions watching on NBA.com. I hope that's how many hits we're getting right here. Listen, Kobe Bryant has three game-winning, buzzer-beating jumpers in the last 29 days. It defies the imagination. Let's show them to you right now. Let's rewind to December 4th. ESPN game at Staples against Miami. Closing moments, Lakers down two. Lakers up one, ball game. Kobe fading away, going glass over one of the great defenders in our game, Dwayne Wade. Kobe called it luck. I call it Kobe being Kobe. Then, December 16th, at Bucks, Kobe Bryant in OT. Lakers down one. And it's unbelievable. If he goes from a tie game to a win, it's like, okay, that's great. But they lose if he misses that shot. He makes it, they win. Then, New Year's Day against Sack. Again, the Lakers down two. Open three. You know it's going in. I don't know what Sergio Rodriguez is doing on the floor. Should have been Andres Nocioni. And I don't know what Sergio Rodriguez is doing getting caught up in the washing machine that way and giving Kobe an open look. A despicable defensive possession for the Sacramento Kings. And once again, unquestioned greatness by Kobe Bryant. So the question is, the question is not, let me start there, is he great? We know he's great. The question is, has Kobe Bryant ever been better in his life than he is right now? He rode the best hot streak since 2003 into the Sunday night matchup with the Dallas Mavericks. Six straight games with at least 34 points. Now, on Sunday, he only had 15 points in a massive blowout Lakers over Mavericks, but the 15 were enough to catch Patrick Ewing for 15th on the all-time scoring list. He leads the league in scoring, does Kobe Bryant, at 30.2 PPG. He's fourth in the NBA in steals at just over two per game. The team has the best record in the NBA because of his greatness. Now, to continue answering the question, is he better than ever? I, I think yes. He's posting up this year. Spent, the, spent some of the summer with Hakeem the Dream Olajuwon working on the post-ups. Now that aspect of his game is better than ever. He can take you down on the block and it's lights out. He has a better understanding of when to push, pull, and pass than ever before. It used to be he got close to that gauge like he'd take some quarters off from shooting and get his guys involved. Now he has full mastery over when to do what he's got to do and when to involve his teammates. Now, Kobe has always had a supreme will to win. It's always been there. But it was never automatic like Michael Jordan back in his day. You knew Michael Jordan was going to hit the game-winning shot. You knew the Bulls were going to win. It was a given. It was guaranteed. It was automatic. Now, with Kobe, whereas you used to think Kobe would hit the game winner at the buzzer. Now you know that shot is going in. And you know the Lakers are going to win if it is close down the stretch because they have Kobe Bryant willing his team to victory like he's never done before. And Kobe Bryant is on like the second hottest streak of his career with a broken right index finger. Check out these numbers. These are the numbers since the avulsion fracture on his right index finger. And you will see that Kobe Bryant is 33-plus points per game, six rebounds, over five assists, and just about two steals per game. Yes, the steals are down. He's got he's to get his hands in there a little bit less because he needs to stay healthy for his team. Those numbers are miraculous when you consider he has a broken right index finger. So... I leave it to you out there in basketball land. Go to my Twitter page. Let me know what you think. It's uh, twitter.com slash NBA TV Rick. Do you think Kobe is better than he ever has? I obviously think that he is. Another question for you. Is anybody close to Kobe Bryant right now for MVP? I don't think so. I think LeBron is second, but I think it's a distant second. The Cavs are one and a half games behind the Lakers, and Kobe has been quite a bit better than LeBron James. Maybe not overall statistically, you know, LeBron the 29-8-8 eight eight or whatever he's doing. I'm talking about game winners. I'm talking about the Lakers being more beat up than the Cavaliers have been this year. Melo is probably third, but he's hurt, and his Nuggets have dipped to fifth best in the Western Conference. Kobe and the Lakers 
the reigning champions in the NBA. They stand above everybody. And I'm here telling you right now, I have never, ever seen Kobe Bryant better than he is right now here today as we start the new year of basketball. Thanks for checking out this rant. I'm Rick Kamla. We'll see you soon.